Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here. I'm just walking through a little marketplace here in Seattle, Washington, meandering around, looking at the sights and sounds, becoming one of Seattle's own in my own personal way. I'm not from Seattle. I'm not real familiar with Seattle, but I am getting familiar with this little market area with some fish over here, people wandering around spending their money on some fantastic, wonderful things. There's a fish. It's a big fish. Shrimp cocktail! Shrimp cocktail! It's better than a lot of that kind of stuff. But it's we got a dip! Pretty cool. It's my second channel, Daily Vlog channel. I think I did that twice. It's the Daily Woo! Seattle, Washington. Just meandering around, I want to show you something amazing that lies below this little region of consumerism right here in Seattle. So let me take you down to the underbelly of the consumeristic area known as this area. I, can't, I don't know exactly where I am, but I think I'm on Pike, Pike Street. This is the Pike Place Fish Company. You'll notice I have gum. Look at this, gum in my mouth. I know it's pretty disgusting, but trust me. That was not as disgusting as what you're about to see momentarily. The gum I have chewed is nothing in the grand scheme of the shenanigans that you are about to witness firsthand from me to you. I figured this vlog needs gum. Everyone needs gum at some point in their life. And today's vlog is justifiably gum. Gum. You got some heat pasting here and some graffiti in this alley. But let me take you down into the nether regions of the alley and keep your focus on gum. Gum is the topic of the day. This is Gum Alley and I brought my gum to add to Gum Alley. Gum Alley started years and years ago in this little corridor underneath Pike Place, Pike Street. Up there is Gum Alley. 14,700,642 and a half sticks of gum are all along this wall. Look at this. This is people's gum, just like my gum that I just showed you. People come out here, they stick their gum on the wall. They go, that's the sound gum makes. That's the sound gum makes when it hits a wall. Millions and millions of pieces of gum. People write their names, graffiti, they stick their gum up on here. Look at this. That was someone's gum. That was in someone's mouth right there. People out here in bewilderment, bewildered people looking at the gum on the gum wall, Seattle, Washington. Gum. A lot of gum. There's even gum on the ground. Look at all the gum on the ground. People getting photo ops with the gum. People come out here and get photo ops with the gum. I'm doing a vlog blog, so I don't really have any room to judge about people getting their pictures with the gum because afterwards I'm going to get my pictures with some gum and put it on the social networks, Facebook backslash The Daily Woo, or Twitter, or Instagram, Adam The Woo. I'm going to do it because I love all the social networks, and obviously all these people love social networks also. And the gum wall out here in Seattle, Washington. It's gum gum out here in Seattle, it's gum out here in Seattle, the gum wall, gum everywhere, gum everywhere out here in Seattle. I had to let those people know that there was gum out here on the gum wall. Check this out, people actually leave their business cards. You should give that guy a call. See if you can find his number and give that guy a call. Stalactites and stalagmites of gum.
That little kid right there just added his gum to the wall. There's excitement in the air, and there's excitement in my mouth in the form of gum. There's gum all around. Gum everywhere. Gum everywhere. <laughs> it's still early. I need some coffee. A little side note, a little tidbit, is right up that alley to the right is the very first Starbucks in existence. The longest running Starbucks coffee. So I'm going to go get myself some coffee. Probably in the form of one of those. A massive bat of coffee is what I need to get my day motivated after seeing and witnessing this wonderful gum wall. This has to be one of the most this has to be one of the most disgusting ledges I've ever seen. That's a very long piece of gum. We have a non-gum item. We have a non-gum item. That's a lollipop. I think I just stepped in gum. I wonder if I just stepped in gum. I have no clue why I would have. Because there's gum everywhere. Vehicles even drive through the gum region. I wonder if that car's ever gotten gum on it, though. It's like one of those drive through safaris. It's a gum drive through safari. Look at this. This used to be some sort of a window where you purchase things. Now covered in gum. It's covered in gum. Look at this. Ring bell for service. Look at that. Look. Ring bell for service. All it is is a piece of gum. you got to ring the gum for service. i got the gum in my mouth. This gum is about to get lodged on the side of one of these bricks. Where should I put my gum? I have no idea where I should put my stick of gum. taking photos. That guy just got photobombed by me. Gum. That's a fun word to say. Gum. I just love saying that word. Gum. What's another word for gum? There is no other word for gum. A lot of things have other words that describe themselves, that have other meanings. Can you think of another word that describes gum? I can't. Gum is just three words. A fantastic word in the form of gum. Sleep. Sleeping there. Okay, I'm going to leave my gum. If you come out here to Seattle, to the gum corridor of goons, check down and look for this area right here. There's going to be a little tiny inclination indentation right here at this end of the gum wall. And I'm going to put my gum right next to this flower, underneath this sleep, right here, next to this little ledge area here. So here is my piece of gum. Prepare yourself. There it is. That's my gum right there. Look. So if you come out here to Seattle, Washington, see if you can find my stick of gum, get a photo opportunity with my gum and all the rest of this gum out here in Seattle. Hit me up on Instagram, hit me up on Twitter and on Facebook. Adam the Woo on all those except Facebook. It's Facebook backslash The Daily Woo. I'm in Seattle, Washington. That was the gum wall. I know it's exciting and excitement and happy. I'm going to go up there to the oldest running Starbucks and get myself a little caffeinated beverage. And I'm going to see you guys tomorrow only if you subscribe up here and up here and all around. Make sure you subscribe all around. Also, check down below for my t-shirts, adamblue.spreadshirt.com. And if you do, this guy right here with the little balloon hat right there, that guy with the balloon hat is going to send you his own personal thank you, vicariously, not really. I've never met that guy before. I've actually never met that guy, but I'm going to go meet him now. I'm going to buy him a coffee. Have a great day. Bye.